kept me on the edge of my seat for the entire film. It was extremely fast paced and thrilling. Um, yeah, it, it just didn't stop once the action started. Um, I didn't get a chance to breathe. So yeah, um, I really enjoyed this film. I thought that the casting and the performances were just amazing, especially um, Tabby's actress. Um, she hit it out of the park with this film. Um, so amazing job there. Um, I loved that most of the film was in the small police station and we had to have you there. Um, yeah, having such a fast paced film in one environment was really interesting, but I think they did a great job with that. Um, all the characters feel very real, which for me raised the stakes a lot. Um, I feel like a lot with a lot of action films, our main characters feel like superheroes. And so we know that they're going to survive in the end. But in this film, I felt like the characters felt like real people um, with real flaws and, you know, human abilities. So for me, that raised the stakes a lot um, and definitely made me more invested in them. Um, the brutal, the more brutal scenes also raised those stakes um, and helped me to really fear for our surviving characters, not wanting them to, to you know, end up like that in those situations. Um, I also really loved the music choices in this film. I loved all the selections. This film has so many dynamics that make it successful. Um, the complex relationship with the mother and son, the law versus the lawbreaker. We immediately see the conflict and the dynamics um, with these two. We also see the dynamics with the cops. The bond between this group is so felt. So when we do lose the cops, we feel that loss because we know how much it has affected Tammy. Tammy's ailment, putting her at an immediate disadvantage, and this unknown threat that is attacking the police station, making her a sitting duck with a gun without the right bullets and one bad leg. But yet she is fearless and relentless. Tammy's character is so complex with her own substance abuse issues, but also her dedicated character as a mother. Then you have the added complication of her son showing up which only heightens the situation. And, and every piece of this heightens. The, the, the thriller and suspense aspect was very clear through this because of the choices to heighten everything. Sun showing up, losing surveillance, not having a gun with bullets. The whole time I'm thinking, what did these men want in the station? And we got some foreshadowing with this whole murder investigation of Jim Dunn and her son's involvement with him. But it, it, it's, it does a really good job of not giving away the ending too soon and so you're really on a journey throughout the whole thing this film is action-packed everyone is an enemy you don't know when when something is going to happen when, when you know and it just keeps you on the edge of your seat the whole time the foreshadowing with the gun becoming a grenade uh was really great um, we saw that as a problem presented very early and then we saw her in the gunfight and every time she shoots the gun, we're thinking, okay, is this going to be the moment? It's going to be a moment. And then the moment that it actually is an issue, um, this happens at the most opportune time ever, uh, which is just, just great timing. Uh, it all connected. It's very intricate and delightful, great writing, well thought out story structure, great developed characters and specifically i love the work with the police cameras on the cars i thought that was so creative and how we could see it just felt like it opened up the world i felt like this was such a bigger production than it probably even was with the dash cams and the the monitor in the sheriff's office and the phone calls um just so well done. Even, you know, all the actors were A+. Plus. The voice actors, the the main actress was award-winning performance, in my opinion. I feel like, you know, seeing her son get shot, not knowing if he's dead or not, her reaction to that was so realistic and natural. So kudos to you, because I know how it is when you're on a set and you have to bring all that energy and the, the person you're working with and the energy is created by everyone there. And it's just, to me, that was magical. And there's so many moments in this that were just so well acted and well done just across the board, a plus for all of that. Um, great characters, great script. Um, the storyline between the son and the mom was wonderful. 
great lighting and cinematography and the, the, the wardrobe and the, the set design and the locations. Everything was just great. It was super suspenseful. And it started off so well um, with the, the landscape shots and the music and the music coming th having been coming through the, the phone headphones. All of those elements were just so well done and just thought out so well. Um, I love that the guy Walter was sort of like the comedic relief, but also you're like, do we trust him to do the right thing? And you had that element there. The script was so well done, but it was so well brought to life by these actors because I wasn't sure. I mean, is this guy going to screw up this whole thing, you know, at the end? Um, or is he going to be able to pull it out? And you just made us care about the characters as well. I think it's absolutely creative to have a character be wounded at the beginning of the film. Um, someone who is going to go the extra mile of hitting this extreme situation of life and danger and pushing themselves to their absolute limit and going, going the mile uh, to do what is right for just ethics and nature but also for herself and her family, um, because she's risking more than just uh, her job here. She's risking her family. Uh, she's risking her future. These underlying um, moments of this act of disconnect between the two. But when things get real, when it becomes life and death, when they're they are being shot at. Love prevails. When we get to this point where her son has been shot at, it gives her that exact need for her character to just get that extra oomph to then take out those who have uh, harmed her. It really comes kind of full circle with all of these uh, little intricacies but it was definitely uh, an enticing thriller that keeps you on your toes to the very end. One thing that needs to be pressed in this uh, feature is um, they just show like a multi faceted like characteristic of being a woman, like in the leading role. And we just kind of see like her like develop like her art from the start, trying to figure out like how to like, you know, uh, Applicate like the corruption as like inside the town and putting them into the justice. And if we like this kind of feature, like we need to see more. Apart from the character part, like the feature has like a strong like editing and transition to make the story move forward like in a good pacing, and also maintaining like a thrilling like aspect of the movie because like. It's a thriller. It needs to be entertained, but uh, enthrall us by like you know the visuals, by the cinematography, which is pretty well done in this movie. So overall, it de it delivers uh, such a good like thriller to follow. The characters are well done. The story makes sense on its own, and other aesthetics aspect of the movie just make itself like a good quality thriller to watch. This film is a never-ending ride from beginning to end. The suspense builds and builds and builds. This is excellent storytelling. I fully enjoyed it. I, From the second way, you're wondering why Tabby is walking with a crutch and clearly wasn't supposed to be at work yet and had to because of this election coming up and stuff like that. And then she has a troublesome son. There's this new guy in town wandering around. At first, it seems like it's going to be a very predictable, suspenseful film. But then the writer and the filmmakers throw in twists and turns. The acting was phenomenal. This didn't really feel like an indie film. It felt like something that you should be able to watch That on Netflix. It's promoted to watch. It's one of those films that should be highly promoted because I think a lot of people in, would enjoy it because it's a never ending ride. It's such a wonderful film to watch because it was remarkable.